back at you. Just got out of uh, church with Boss Baby. This is where we go right here. Don't mind my bad nerves. Asbury United Methodist Church. Love going there. We go and get our praise on in and out one hour. Love it. You know what I mean? Not sitting in church all day. Not that I have a problem with that or anything like that, but come on. Also got a gift today from my white parents, Joe Ola and Sue Ola. Look at that. <laughs> it's a kid's book and all that, but Aaron is cool. And I like it because it's got danger thin ice right there. It's like the story of my life right there. You know what I mean? But you see, as you can see, that alligator Aaron is still cooling in a fan. No worries in the world. You know what I mean? Check him out. So that's how I feel basically somewhat like I'm always skating on thin ice and all that, you know what I mean? And uh, always got some shit to go through or whatever. I'm tired, but I got a little bit of time. So instead of taking a nap or doing anything like that that normal people do, I also have work that I could be getting done too. So I could be getting that done while Josiah is with his sissy right now. You know, I'm not, I know me and Tatiana have our issues and all that stuff like that, but I'll never keep her brother away from her, even though that's how she puts it out there. But it is what it is. So I'm gonna chill, get my medical on and relax my mind for a little bit, have a cup of coffee, maybe clip some coupons. As you, I already got dinner situated and everything like that, you know, so we'll do not a big leftover fan. Depends on what it is. Like, I see tacos, I'll do leftovers, spaghetti, pretty much anything Italian I'll do leftovers with, you know what I mean? Um, especially my lasagna, my lasagna. Um, let's see, steak I'll do leftovers with just for one day. Um that pretty much chicken just depends on if it was how it was cooked you know what i mean i'll do leftovers with that but other than that nah i'm not a big leftovers fan or anything like that and i'm not bougie either it's just that i'm not a big fucking leftovers fan you know what i mean but some things taste better the next day like once again anything italian the next day, yeah, that's that's great. Tastes better, flavor and sat all in and all that stuff like that. You know, so let's see how I'm gonna get my medical on. I might slide out over to, you know, um, the beer distributor out there in Spring Grove, why not? You know what I mean? They are. Uh, I want to see if they're interested in putting some uh, Pennsylvania skill games in their store so I can have at least one customer for them and all that stuff. So, uh, everybody's doing it and putting it in their stores and all that and that attracts the customers and all that stuff to go play. Unless he already has them in there. But if I can get that guy to get one or two machines. And they like me over there anyway. It's a white-owned company and all that. There's a few few of them businesses and all that that really look out for black-owned businesses and all that stuff, small business owners. And, you know, that guy, like, when I go in there and say, hey, I'm doing this for the community, jumps right in there. You know, so... I'm gonna drink this cup of coffee, really. Actually, I'm probably not gonna drink this cup of coffee now. Did I already make it? Nope, I didn't. So instead, I'm gonna have me a damn adult slushy. Since my little man is with a sissy for about two hours, so I get two hours to myself. Then I'm going to go ahead and at least go over there and see if that guy wants to put them in them uh, slot machines in the store and all that. Guys, come on with me. I got a... Um, whew, 
Mike Nice was supposed to cut me up today and get Josiah, but who knows what the hell he's got going on. That's crazy. Can't wait to get my Chase Robot, though, ordered off of Amazon, you know what I mean? So I ain't got to be carrying the camera around and looking all big <laughs> and having it all shaking. Let me get some different kicks to put on. I'm supposed to organize my closet and do all that today. So I'll probably do that later on. Finish putting on my wall decor in the room and in the hallways and downstairs. Got some wall shelves coming. Make this place look a little bit more homey and homebound and more Von Sway, you know, because people used to come in or, well, when people did come over, it'd be like, are you moving? Did you just move in? You know, so, and being a bachelor, and all that stuff, single dad. I mean, I just had the necessities in here, really. I never really put pictures on the wall except for my kids' pictures or any kind of home decor. I wasn't really, I don't know. Just as long as we had TV, stuff to watch, food to eat, and furniture, that was pretty much all I really needed. But now I kind of stepped it up as I was, you know, adding stuff onto there, starting to look a little bit more homey and all that. I, I really like it. So I'm going to keep doing it up, adding more plants. I'm a plant type of guy. I really love plants. Um, not just because I smoke them, <laughs> but I really do like plants. And, uh, let's see here. That's pretty much everything in a nutshell, you know. Like I said, I'm going to finish cooking. Like cooking all I'm going to make today is some deviled eggs and broccoli to go along with that steak and uh, shrimp alfredo that I made Saturday night for dinner. So, um... We're going to go from there. I'm going to roll up these damn sleeves because Mother Nature tricked the hell out of me today thinking it's going to be 64 degrees and it's well past 70. So, Siri had it all wrong. But it is what it is. You know, still a G. So, still look good. Single dad life. Damn right. So, as I go ahead and get ready to do what I do, and I said, instead of getting a nap in or whatever, I can rest later on. You know what I mean? And go ahead and get situated. Ow. Ow. See the sombreros, the Taco Tuesday. Y'all see the crazy mats too. You know what I mean? And let's see here, list the goals and all that stuff like that. And my favorite quote, as long as you're alive, you will either live to accomplish your own goals and dreams, or you will be used as a resource to accomplish someone else's goals and dreams. Think about that. As long as you're alive, you will live to accomplish your own goals and dreams. Or you, yes, I'm talking to you. You will be used as a tool, a resource to accomplish someone else's goals and dreams. Are you a tool? I'm not. I'm a well-oiled machine, my man. Everybody listening. I go hard. And I'm going to continue to do that. Single dad life. It doesn't matter. I'm just going with the hand I was dealt. And I'm not folding not giving in because it's not in my spirit <laughs> i can't do it now let me go ahead and handle my business and go over here and talk to the peoples and i'll get back with y'all in a second peace <laughs>